I'm Paul Garabedian, Senior Media Analyst for Comscore, and I want to talk about the month of August at the box office. I call it the punk rock month. Why? Because movies released in August generally are edgier, they're original IP, studios are willing to take a shot on movies that they might not otherwise feel comfortable putting in the heat of the summer movie months, May, June, and July. And so what do we end up with as the audience? Some great movies. Straight out of Compton, took the box office by storm when it opened August 14 of 2015, wound up earning $162 million at the domestic box office. Super bad, another great movie. At the time, that movie was positively scandalous in its portrayal of teen sexuality and a night out in the valley having a lot of, uh, you know, let's just say fun, for lack of a better word. And then of course, going back in time, Risky Business. Tom Cruise, not his first film, but a fantastic movie, pretty edgy, R-rated fair. Again, we find a lot of that in August. And of course, Apocalypse Now, another great movie that was an August release. And now with Bullet Train, we have another example of a brand new film that's not a franchise film, it's original, starring Brad Pitt. So August, again, bringing to audiences not your typical summer fair, but movies that fit into summer, into the summer months, but deliver a great, edgy, original movie-going experience. We should all celebrate that as moviegoers. So I'm Paul DeGarabedian, Senior Media Analyst for Comscore, talking about my favorite month at the box office, and I'll see you at the movies. <laughs> all I need are some tasty waves, cool buzz, and I'm fine. <laughs>